Hi, here's a simple patch to fatten up the Mother 32 with two extra VCOs using mouse channel 1 and 4 in cycle mode. First, set up the Mother 32 in mouse like this. Okay, flip the VCA switch to on on the Mother 32 and turn the attenuverter on channel 1 of mouse up. This is your volume control for the mouse VCO1. If you set it up like in the patch drawing you made, you'll probably have a cross between a triangle and a saw wave. If we keep the rise at zero and turn the fall up or down, we can tune our VCO. Uh, changing the very response control from logarithmic uh, through to linear to exponential will affect the tuning, but will also change the wave shape. A tiny turn uh, clockwise towards exponential will give us a pointier saw. Tuning this can be a bit of a pain. Turning up channel 4, we'll add the second VCO for mass. Because we're going out the sum output of mass, the attenuverters now act as a mixer. In this case, I tuned uh, the oscillator to a fifth to get that classic mini Moog type sound. Uh, I created an inverse saw or a ramp wave by keeping the fall at zero and tuning with the rise. Um, I'll mute channel four for a second to show the different wave shapes. Here's one, and here's four. A ramp wave. I can turn it back to a saw by turning the attenuator counterclockwise. See, there's our saw, there's our ramp. Mixing the two VCOs together, get some interesting phasing sounds. If they're slightly out of tune, we'll get phasing effects like on an old multi-oscillator synth. Turning the mix on the M32 counterclockwise will add the M32's VCO. Math's output is much lower than the M32's. Uh, in this patch, to keep it easy, I'm using the external in and mixing the VCOs entirely within the two modules. But using a mixer module or an outboard mixer might be a good idea if you want to pan the VCOs or get more output from Math's. As you can hear, we get a little over an octave with decent enough pitch tracking. It'd be even better if I spent a little more time tuning the math's VCOs, but math does seem to track best in the lower octaves. A bit about the patch if you haven't figured it out. The KBCV out from Mother32 is malted and set to modulate the both inputs on channel one and four of the maths. This is how we're getting the pitch to track. Both rise and fall of the maths oscillators are being adjusted equally by the KBCV. I'll show you how to get better pitch tracking by patching maths as a subharmonic generator or by using other modules like an Expert Sleepers ES3 or uh, Ableton Live CV tools to track the pitch in another video. If we turn the mix control, we can get kind of a quasi-amplitude modulation going between the Mother 32's VCO and the Maths VCO's. But uh, I've got this patch set up to do this automatically with the VC mix control. sub oscillator. Let's turn down channel 4 in maths for a second and move the cable over to the LFO rate. Now the Mother 32's LFO rate is being tracked by the KBCV and is essentially acting as another oscillator. So let's take a stackable cable. And molt this back. So we've molted to the LFO rate and back into channel four of maths. And now I'm going to take the 
LFO square wave and patch it into channel 3 of baths. Now we have four VCOs. Let's hear how it sounds.